Hi VC, send you back again, bring you another video. Today I want to show you my vinyl finds, my recent vinyl finds, plus a new a few grails that I I needed in my collection. Um, and thankfully I found a few copies online at uh, very good price. Um, so let's go right ahead because it's a big stack that I have here. So let's start off with this one. This one I, ha I only have a forty-five of it. Um, I was um I never got this one. I just hold back on getting it, I don't know why. And it's an iconic album, but I saw the Netflix documentary of the you know, about this album and you know, it pumped me up to get it. And I know many people out there have done the same because this, this album uh, is getting sold out everywhere right now online. So, of course, I'm talking about USA uh, for Africa. We are the world. I found a mint copy. It has everything. Um, it's complete. It has even the merchandise form in it. And I'm very stoked because this is like brand new. It's never been played. Uh, so it's mint. So I'm very happy and just because I saw the documentary it really got me to getting it so I finally have it in my collection I remember this song was <clears throat> played non-stop oh my god on the radio on MTV it was everywhere every five seconds you can hear it at any station my local stations over where I lived um but yeah one, one an uh, iconic album I'm also on the hunt to get hearing aid that's the metal version of this with the song stars uh um that one has gone in price so i'm trying to find a decent copy you can find copies but they're mostly beat up a lot of ring wear so yeah oh yeah thank you for i'm, I'm so thanks for, for having that one next is a, another common title that i i needed in my collection i don't know why i haven't gotten it before and it's uh, one of my favorites from this band Especially a, a song that is in this album that I, I listened to it when I was a kid so many times. And I'm talking about Super Tramp's Famous Last Words. And the song that I'm referring to is It's Raining Again. Another one that I heard a lot when I was a kid and I really loved it. Remember kids in my school even sang it all the time. So another minty copy that I found. Uh, also, I've seen this in the wild, but mostly, again, beat up all the time. You know, a lot of rain wear, scratches. But... Um, and it's from the same seller that I got that one, and I got another one from the same seller. I got three albums, and they're all mint, like they were never played. So, yeah, Super Champ, Famous Last Words, awesome album, highly underrated, in my opinion. And everybody, people talk about Bref Breakfast in America, but I like that one a lot. Also, this is another one that I, I used to listen to it a lot when I was a kid, and sadly, this artist no longer with us, uh, passed away. From cancer sadly um, and I'm talking about Donna Summer she works hard for the money this is one of my favorite and uh, the my favorite Donna Summer from um, album from the 80s um, it has of course the hit she, uh, she, she worked hard for the money but there's another one um, in collaboration with um, Sonic Youth and it's um, Unconditional Love and Sonic Youth? Uh, yeah, I think so. <laughs> I know there's another band with that same name um, or similar. But anyway, Donna Summer, she works hard for the money. Another minty copy. I'm so happy I have this one. And what a, what a talent, what a voice. Um, sadly, she's no longer with us. I really miss her all the time. Okay, now from the new. Um, Another one that I got, uh, oh, I forgot to say, mostly all these are birthday gifts. My birthday is tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. Happy birthday to me. Uh, this one I got, I, was, I, got, I got it from my sister for Chris, um, Christmas. Um, for St. Valentine's Day, tomorrow, my, my, my birthday. And it's, I've been, I talk about this all the time. I really enjoy these albums. I love collecting them. And this one is now, that's what I call 90s R&B. Great, great album, it has many songs. Um, tracklist is Mar Mariah Carey, Fantasy. Mary J. Blige, Real Love. And Vogue, My Lovin', You're Never Gonna Get It. Vogue, Bib the Vogue with Poison. Bobby Brown, Humping Around. 
Montel Jordan, this is how we do it. Uh, that's a good song. Donald Jones, you know what's up. Babyface, White Appeal. Casey and Jojo, All My Life. Brandy and Monica, This Boy Is Mine. Brian McTank, Anytime. Tony Braxton, Unbreak My Heart. And the last song on side B is Whitney Houston's Excel. Shoo, shoo. So yeah, that's, that's the track list on this um, comp. And it's a Target exclusive, like you see there. So yeah, I'm very, very happy to got this one. I enjoy collecting those, like I always say. This one is uh, another one that I don't have. I only had one album from this band, and I needed this one. It's a, my second favorite. My 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 first favorite is the one that I have. And I'm talking about Pearl Jam Versus. Um, I, the, the album I'm referring to that I have is 10. I enjoy that album. I really needed this one also. And it's the... 30th anniversary uh, edition. It's a, a gay fold. It's, I got the Target exclusive. It's clear vinyl. Um, I don't know if it's the same. I, I heard that uh, this reissue is a 40, uh, it's a half piece master, uh, but I don't know. Right now, probably it is because I can see here it has another sticker on there. And I know I've seen people posting this online, and the sticker says half piece master, but this one doesn't say it. So I have to check that out if it is half speed master or not. But yeah. So stoked we finally have this one. Okay. Next is two albums uh, from a band that I really enjoy also. And these are two iconic um, albums. They're new reissues from Nuclear Blast Records. And I'm talking about Exodus. This is Blood In Blood Out. Another fun animal. Uh, Phenomenal <laughs> um, album. This is thrash metal, but it looks more like death metal cover, right? And wow, well, what can I say? Exodus is awesome. And like I said, this is new. It's a uh, clear with gold black splatter vinyl. Oh, yeah, got that. Next, another one from Exodus. And this is another ratio. They both got ratio, I think, the same, the same time. This Tempo of the Dam. Um, this is this one is is a killer album. Yeah, this one comes in a natural with yellow and red splatter vinyl. So I'm very happy to have this. I still need um uh, a couple of them. I that I, I I have. I think I have one album. Like this, like three albums. I have of them. I'm trying to find their earliest album. Their at least the first three. Uh, so yeah. It's not very hard to, to get. They, they got ratio, but they went out of print. So I'm still looking for the first three Exodus albums. And yeah, Tempo of the Dance. Right. Next, this is a band that I discovered last year. I, I recently got a, an album from them and I, I loved it. Um, as you can say there, it's like glam rock, sleaze rock, and wow, well, I, I fell in love with it. And I'm trying to get oh there are like three or four albums they have in the discography i got one i just got this one and i'm talking about the band hitten or hitting i really really highly recommend this album um i band i mean this is triumph and tragedy tragedy and it's uh this is a high low a high roller record and it it's a mixed splatter final you can see right here it's supposed to be looking like that oh yeah like I say, guys, I highly recommend this band. If you like glam, sleaze, uh, you name it. Uh, really awesome, awesome album. I, and awesome band. I, I streamed this online, so I, I really enjoyed it. Um, I think they have one more, I think. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get that pretty soon when I can. But yeah, hitting. Uh, great, great band. Highly recommend. Now I'm going to show you some grails that I want. And I'm, I was looking, uh, the first two are from one band that these uh, just got reissued, I think last year. And this one is the Almighty. And this is Soul Destruction uh, from Silver Lining Music. Um, this just got reissued. Uh, I'm so happy. I really wanted these. And yeah. The Almighty, it's an underrated band in my opinion. So, Soul Destruction, great album. I listened to it, I have it on cassette, and wow, amazing. And 
I was even more stoked and and amazed. I thought that was the only one that got ratio. When I went online, I saw the store had this had this one also on. Um, and this is one of those grails that I wanted to be on vinyl. Um, I have the cassette. I did a video a couple of months back saying about it that I have it on cassette that I wish I had it on vinyl. And wow, behold, it got reissued. And about the Almighty's debut album, Blood, Fire, and Love. I am so freaking stoked that I got this one. This is their debut album. You can see the guys right there in the back. And I'm so happy that this got reissued finally. Like I said, it's one of those underrated bands from the uh, late 90s, I mean, late 80s, early 90s. And I highly recommend The Almighty. It's a great band. And I'm, like I said, so freaking happy that I found this and, and it got reissued. Again, from Silver Lining Music Records, so yeah. Okay, now is a record that, um. I wanted to get this for a long time, but first, uh, the price on this has gone up. This is not the first original pressing. You can say this is the first pressing of this record label. And I'm talking about Metallica Kelamon. Uh, we all know the original first pressing is from Megaforce Records, but this is the Electra uh, Records version. And of course, it's the one that has this Creek and Am I Evil in there and i'm so happy i finally found a copy of this i really wanted it a long time i have it on cd and i really wanted a copy on vinyl but the thing is not only i found one copy i found two the only difference is this one is kind of beat up see but this one is in better condition see, it's kind of in the back you see it's very it has a lot of ring wear and the album inside is kind of, you know, has a few scratches. I haven't tested it yet. But the reason I got both of them, because I, I didn't know which one's going to be better. And they both cost the same price. I got them on this cock overseas from a seller. But I also got an album from, uh, I got two more albums that from that seller overseas. So I said, oh, what the heck, they, they cost us it. I already got them from 30 bucks each. I know, $30, I can't, I can't, I cannot, you cannot beat that. This album is going for more than $100 online, especially on eBay. And I got both of them for 30 bucks each. And this one was stated VG, and this one were VG plus. So I said, well, let, let, let me get them both. Maybe I'll VCLT it, I don't know, so. Uh, I don't like to give out, you know, copies like this, but if somebody probably wanted, you know, we'll see. So anyway, yeah, I got Kill em All. I only have the reissues, uh, Bulma ratio and the Black ratio. And then I got another one from that same seller that I also, I have it on CD. I also want it, another Grail. And it's, of course, White Tiger, their only album they released. Another great uh, a band that I really enjoy, White Tiger, and this one is a mint, near mint copy. So stoked to have this one in my collection. Oh yeah, and last but not least, another one that I really want, but this is a promo copy from the same seller, and it's of course Leather Wolf, Street Ready. Um, also that I have in CD, I really want it on vinyl, and wow, really, really, really happy to got, finally got this in my collection. And it says right here, it's a promo copy right here. I wish it, it would have been in the back, but what the heck. And it also has a, yeah, you know, cut, a saw cut there, but the vinyl is like mint. That's the most important thing. Only has a little bit of ring wear here in the, here in the back. But the vinyl is spotless, you know, mint. Uh, I'm very happy. Oh yeah, leather, leather wolf. I'm trying to find um, the, re the rest of their catalog pretty soon, but this is my favorite uh, album from from them, from 1989, so yeah. So yeah, um, this is, those are my vinyl finds. Um, many of them, like I said, are birthday gifts, so I hope you guys have a great week and happy have a happy St. Valentine's Day tomorrow, tomorrow Wednesday. And like I always say, Enjoy music and keep rocking. Rock on, guys. Bye.